Good morning and welcome to another video. So I am uh, here down in Hazelbank, feeling pretty good, especially after yesterday's hike up Divis, and uh, it's been pretty good. Feeling quite, feeling quite energised really. Just shaking off my legs, doing my uh, my warm up, and. Uh, looking good so I'm parked up down in Hazelbank so I figured that I do most of the running down here so I might as well just start off here and finish here so I've got a nice loop that I can go down to it's a cracking morning it's about 10 to 9 uh, not too hot so oops, loads of people down there social distancing so yeah loving it so I'm going to uh, Follow this. Get my get my uh, first couple of shuttles done, and hopefully, if it finishes, I should be down at the bottom of the lock shore. If not, I've got a really big hill to run up, which is going to suck. So that's uh, week one will be over in 30 minutes, probably less now. I'm almost finished my warm up, and I will talk to you more at the end. So I'm going to go breathe out my ass, and I'll see you at the end. That is uh, the run finished. Although Sarah's just said something very weird in my ear. Uh, I have two more runs to do before I can progress to week two. Uh, I hope I haven't hit run one or run two and repeated them. But I'll have to check when the app finishes. But either way, if it has, I'll just have to repeat. I'll just do run three. I don't think it'll do me any harm, to be fair. Uh, yeah, my shins were seriously so uh, not as bad as the last run I did on Friday still saw but I was still able to I was still still able to to run and I, I felt as though it was for probably for the first time that I was able to sort of run for 60 seconds at a steady speed and um, without slowing down or just a nice comfortable pace uh, so that's the first time that that's happened um, I presume that could be progress I imagine but still uh, we'll find out on the next one but if that has if I have hit the button right and I have just done run three then what I'll do is move on to week two which means I'll be running for that's just Sarah telling me to eat bananas so I'll have to check actually, but uh, yeah, w week two is a 90 second run with a 60 second break and we do that eight times. So getting you to run slightly longer, with slightly less break. Um, my route, actually quite good actually. Uh, I was able to actually run a lot further out along the lock shore than I expected. I expected only to get so far uh, and then having to finish and then I anticipated a, a nice walk up a hill, but that didn't actually pan out that way. Morning. So, yeah, all in all, from start to finish, about two kilometers, which is not bad. Um, just got a small, small walk back to the car now. Uh, but yeah, either way, the route, it actually worked out a lot better. Um, sort of starting at the car park, coming around the top edge, and then uh, coming in, working down onto the the actual lock shore shorefront itself, and then running across that that path. And I went out so far, and then once they rung the bell, and I knew I was halfway, then I just turned around and uh, come back. So basically, four shuttles out four shuttles in so worked it worked really well um so i now need breakfast i need water it's uh it's, a, it's going to be a warm day but there's a nice cool breeze which is good uh, so yeah but yesterday run up uh, run walk up divis was really good um really enjoyed it challenging 5k in about an hour and a half uh 
so if you want to see the stats and stuff for that it's over on my instagram channel i put got the uh, pictures from the app of the route uh, and all my my breakdown for the hike itself uh, being told it it was good um, I'll do the same for this run today now I know how to do it I put that up on Instagram and uh, so yeah it was really good stuff I see the same before the start I had a, a guy comment on my YouTube channel uh, under the last the, last, the, the, the first video saying that my video inspired him to start it himself it felt really really good knowing that my pain and suffering has inspired someone else to inflict pain and suffering on themselves yay so it's really cool so thank you very much and the actual the comments i've been getting as well have been really really cool uh it's really nice to know that you've got support and people are actually rooting for you because this is hard this is hard work um, I'm really actually looking forward to week two. I really do hope I haven't pressed the wrong button. I'd be a dick if I have. But if I have, Wednesday morning I'll do what should have been today, the last run. And then I'll crack into, into week two on Thursday. Because my two days off work. Uh, but run wasn't built in a day. And this is definitely not going to take me a day to get into shape but baby steps that I learned to walk before I run right I'm almost back of the car and I'm getting quite a few funny looks from the, the, the very friendly people of Northern Ireland they've said hello to me a lot this morning and I'm going to head back to the house and I'm going to have a nice big banana a big pint of water and then I'm going to think about maybe having some breakfast so thank you again for all the support uh, if you like this and you're enjoying me rambling on about how much in pain I am then fire me a sub you know ring the bell so you can definitely get informed it also helps with YouTube's algorithms as well because they're they're dicks and uh, like the video and I'll see you in the next one bye bye